Sometimes Scooby and I are told that our advice sucks or is for whims or will get you nowhere because we stress safety so much and tell people to be really careful with squats, deadlifts and bench pressing when they want to work out at home by themselves. Well, there is a reason for that. Um, yesterday I read a news item by Fox News and Fox News reported that a 16 year old teenager from Wisconsin was bench pressing in his parents basement while home alone and apparently the weight slipped, dropped on him and he wasn't able to lift it off. When his mom later came home she found him there still lying under the weight and she called the paramedics but all the paramedics could do when they arrived was um, pronounce him dead. So a 16 year old teenager is dead because of the bench pressing he did at home. Now some of you might think that he simply didn't know what he was doing or he was stupid but neither is true. First of all he was a football player at his high school and regularly worked out so he had experience with weights and second this also has nothing to do with being stupid but a lot with being human and humans simply make mistakes. Um, if you think you know all about bench pressing and can safely do that at home without a safety rack because you're so intelligent or strong or so experienced then imagine you have a cat um, are lying in your basement going for your one rep max in bench pressing and suddenly you, your cat jumps on you um, claws out. Will you still be able to control the weight or will you be startled enough to drop it? So these things happen no matter how experienced you are and your number one uh, concern and top priority with whatever you do in uh, fitness and weightlifting should be your own safety. Because to put this a bit sarcastically, your one rep max will suck badly when you're dead.